Fatine means? Don't use such big words, Fatine. Look under the wall, Crane. <sighs> and get back here quickly if you want to see something amazing. Sideways. Looks like the big guy wrecked this car. Must have been what they carried off. What the hell happened here? Hey, you there? A strange phenomenon doesn't even come close. What do you mean, brother? I mean, there was this huge ass demolisher just standing there in the field, didn't even notice me. And this Weird mist, too, like what you guys had at the ceremony. Oh, well, that's an interesting development. Brother, I can't really tell you right now, but it just seems far. Soon, I believe you are ready. It's good to see you again, brother. This time, though, I fear I carry some bad news for you. Yeah, well, I'm used to that by now. What's going on here? Kyle, you already knew, didn't you? People not getting infected, that it's just smoke and mirrors. It is the smoke, literally. Our mother found a way to fight the sickness using a certain, let's call it an elixir. You have seen it working with your own eyes. So you do have a cure? Would you call a bandage on an open wound a cure? No. What we have right now is just a temporary solution. We are working on a certain curative project, one with more permanence. But we need time, and we need peace to last for just a bit longer. And let me guess, you're running out of this elixir. Unfortunately, yes. That's why I asked you to come here. I want to offer you a deal. Find us more of it, and a fair portion will be yours. The mother will teach you how to use it. You'll be able to return to Haran with your prize, or perhaps you'll choose to stay with us. It seems like you've got an idea of where to look for this stuff. A lot of our brothers were out searching for it, and recently we lost contact with three of them. They were supposed to check a certain cave. Your seeing the mist cannot be a coincidence. It must have been spillage. Seems that someone found the elixir and ran away with it. All right, so check out the cave. Got it. Farewell, brother. I hope the news you bring back is good. Lena. Kyle, why haven't you contacted us? 
You know, listen good while this damn thing works. I know what's going on. They have something a hundred times better than Antizin. The good news, they'll share it with me. The bad news, I need to find it. Now, I know the clock's ticking, but I can't let go of this yet. It's the best chance for all of us. I understand the Kyle, but please, please hurry. Run out of Antizin. More reason for me to get this done. Keep your fingers crossed. That's one of them. Okay, second one's dead too, no surprise there. Holy fuck, Rises men? are undamaged. All right, then where are they? Are you there? I'm at the cave you mentioned, and I found two of your brothers dead. I also heard a distress call. It mentioned some goods that aren't here. So they were stolen. All right. Please keep investigating. We'll try to gather some information about the third brother. Listen, be on the lookout for orange uniforms, or, or a symbol, three horizontal stripes. Bandits in here. These are Rise's thugs. They're worse than the undead. What happened in Haran? That's mostly their fault. Oh, I see. Thank you, Kyle. I'm sure that information will prove useful.
There's so many. Please take this. You saved my life. Everybody home. Come to kill me. Fine. Go ahead. Have you come to kill me? Fine. Go ahead. My name's Kyle Crane. The mother's worried about you, Attila. She sent me to check on you. Make sure you're okay. I am most certainly not okay. You can tell her that there will be no book. I've hit a wall. I'm just a dying old man, not Indiana Jones. Dying? Did, did you ask the mother for help? She doesn't have the cure for cancer, I'm afraid. My days of field work are over. The problem is, and I'll quote Hamlet here, everything is fucked up. Come, sit. Have a drink with me, Mr. Crane. Listen, if it's the field work that's stopping you, just... I can go out and get whatever you need. I don't know what you're researching, but the mother really wants it finished. Hmm. You'll bring me anything I need. You say? Yeah, sure. Just make a list. It would certainly help if my electricity were restored. If I'm going to do this, I'll be looking at some very long nights. Well, I can take care of the power, but you're on your own for coffee.
Get your electricity back, Attila, and now what? Now we can get to work, Mr. Crane. I'm researching traces of the prophecy about the god of the sun in the relics of local culture. It seems like a matter of life and death to the mother, and I'm in no position to ask why. So, now we have three ancient monoliths to investigate. We're looking for specific features, so you'll need to see them in person and describe each one to me. Now that I have the power back on, we can stay in touch while you're out there. But please hurry, Mr. Crane. I won't live forever.